Welcome, Waffle Warvets, to the brilliant Warhammer 40k Space Marine 2 on the PlayStation 5. And I hope you guys and girls are having an absolutely fantastic day. Now what we're going to be doing today is we need to head over to a data facility to collect some important data so that we can persuade a guy called Nozick to leave this planet because he is a very high value person, even if he is a bit of a cockwomble every time he talks to us. So let's get straight into things. Now we defeated the boss of this area in the previous video, so if you want to see the boss battle, just watch the ending of the previous episode. But we're going to be heading into the data facility now where we have to deal with a bunch of Special really weird ready. small enemies that sort of remind me of the rats from A Plague Tale Innocence and Requiem. Actually, it's probably more a Plague Tale Requiem, actually. There's a bunch of things that the rats do in that game that these enemies also do as well. <laughs> they are an absolute nightmare. Oh, is that a new gun? Rapid fire, mid-range car... Have we, have we had that before? Let us get to work. Well, I picked it up. Oh, hang on a minute, look! It's a blue helmet! Hey, look, Karen. We can finally stop you looking like an absolute wanker! Hey, there you go, mate! Maybe if you uh, actually have a set of armor that matches, you'll stop being such an aggressive git when you talk to me. Go on, get the helmet on. The facility is in ruin. Let us hope Nozick's research remains intact. Archmagos, we have arrived. What the? Oh, I thought that was somebody's arm. <laughs> oh, it might be, uh, oh, I think it's one of the uh, guardsmen's backpacks in it, maybe. That looks like one of their helmets as well. Oh, you got a crushed tank over here. That's got a bit of a scope on it, actually. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to sprint down this bridge, because I swear there's a bunch of snipers around here. I recommend you two run with me as well. Oh, yeah, he is a sniper. Just dodged it like Neo, though. Not today, bitch. Oh, who did that? <laughs> who the hell did that? That was you, wasn't it, Karen? Because I insulted your flipping helmet again and you're not happy about it. Archmagos, the entrance is inoperative. Stand by. Why are you so fucking angry, mate? Get yourself a Snickers. Oh, no. Expect enemy presence. Well, yeah, I mean, I, I did already expect enemy presence. <laughs> it was a bit of a shit statement, that was. Be a bit of a crap game if there was no enemy presence. Unless we've just been, uh. Unless we've just. We, we might have been misjudging all of these enemies in video games because it's called enemy presence. Oh, look, a data slate. But it's called enemy presence. So maybe the enemies have been trying to give us presence and we've just been taking it the wrong way and shooting them. Man, all these video games that we could have just solved in 10 minutes. I'm gonna skip this. Because some of these uh, data slates go on for a while. Rally at the elevator. Oh. Verify your signature is detected in lift one one nine. How disappointingly slow progress for Anastasis. Spare me the insults, Magos. Statement error. Insults. I have had more pleasant conversations with orcs. Yeah, we have. I mean, the orcs are flipping hilarious in Dawn of War. Because you fight the orcs in Space Marine 1. I wish they was in this game. Oh, actually, I hope they are in this game. I think they are adding other factions later, if I read the uh, roadmap correctly. Maybe they'll add orcs. That'd be nice.
God, I remember uh, loading screens back on the PS4. Every PS5 game I played didn't have any loading screens. So uh, seems like you need to sort the game out a little bit, Saber. We have arrived at Nozick's facility. Run distraction efforts as long as you can. I will fight in the thick of his Xenos as long as you need. I will hold you to that. Yeah, Decimus is a uh, part of the other other squad, and they're currently trying to uh, set something off in the mines to cause a distraction. He deserved better. Are you talking about him? Neither of you even turned around. How the fuck did you see him? <laughs> Got eyes in the back of the head. This pyro blaster will serve us well against rippers. Oh. Gadriel to resilient. Brother Decius has fallen. Received. Location marked for apothecary. Our brother's sacrifice will be remembered. Uh. Yeah, flamethrower keeps these guys back. You see what I mean? Let's see. See how it's like a. Uh, See how it's like um, a Plague Tale Requiem. They turn into like a big swarm of rats and dive at you, just like in uh, that game. They must have got the idea from that. They must have. <laughs> Unless it's just part of the lore that I don't know about. It's a pain in the ass. this whole section. The little stupid things on the floor ain't so bad, the rippers or whatever they are. But it's when other enemies join the fight. That's when it's a bloody nightmare. Munitions secured. Better look up here then. Oh, good job I did. Because we are going to need that. Give me a lot of ammo. <laughs> Drone. There must be thousands. That door looks like our exit. Clear a path through those vermin. Okay, uh, whatever you do, don't go over that side yet. You might think I'll go over there and look for collectibles. No, you've got to go over there anyway, so don't waste your fuel. This is why I like doing playthroughs before I uh, upload to YouTube, because you know, I can give you just little tips like that. Not too important, but useful. Just be careful it don't overheat. Power system controls and your current location. Yeah, see, now you got to come round here. Shoot! Well, you better keep them off me. Oh no! They look a bit like uh, aliens, didn't they? Oh no, we've overheated. Do not get too close. Recovering. No, what do you fuck off? I was burning ya. <laughs> Ow. No! You lot need to help me out. <laughs> the Rippers, they retreat. Disoriented by the synaptic shock. The floor is clear. Let's go. I don't know if you, if you boys noticed, but I am nearly dead. <laughs> I am nearly dead. And I've got no stim left. 
I hate this entire set. Like, honestly, I hate this whole mission. <laughs> well, the first half of the mission, up until the uh, the Victor or whatever it was called, that was all right. But this bit, oh fuck me, nah. I just saw a dude down there peeking at us, which means he's probably making a plan. Probably telling his mates where we are. Well, that's like, oh. Oh, what a reflex that was. Oh, sorry, uh, Gadriel. I accidentally nearly hit you. <laughs> oh. Resupply. Oh, there you go. That's why you want to go off the beaten path. The Emperor protects. Nice. These abominations are busy with something. They gather biomass. Humans. Dissolved and collected later. By feeding tubes lowered from orbit. Vile. The fuck? The sooner we exterminate these horrors, the better. Well, it's not their fault, you know. That's just the way that they were made, you know. You, you, you can't do nothing about it, you know. It, that's just the way they live life. <laughs> well, they're dissolving humans and creating, like, fucking weird hives out of melted people. Oh, yummy. That's even worse than the aliens in Alien. It's a bit easier to use the chainsaw at the moment. Well, we roasted a bunch of them. It's aggravating that you can't switch between your heavy weapons, like your flamethrower or your heavy bolter, to your normal weapons. That's a bit of a pain in the butt. Restocking. Oh. I'm going to take the frag Restocking. grenades. I don't think we're going to need the crack grenades as much. Reloading. That door over there should open. You want to get out of the way, Karen? You're gonna get you get roasted, mate. Now, good job, there ain't no friendly fire. Just hell divers too. He'd be fucking butchered. Well, quick, let me get in there. Now, I sizzled both of them. Lovely. Munition secured. Nice. But well, let me come back here a minute, because I swear this door randomly opens. How'd you get it to open? Uh, when I was playing off camera, it just opened, unless you can interact with this, maybe. Oh, there you go. I don't know what was in there. It might have been a stim. Oh, shit. We've got a lot of friends. <laughs> maybe I should have left it shut. This flamethrower is pretty damn powerful. If you can, if you can get the uh, enemies to leave you alone, it's pretty damn powerful. Oh shit, we've fucking summoned the mother load again. <laughs> he roars a bit like Kratos. Right, there's a bolt rifle in here. Plasma pistol. Flamethrower ammo. Maybe there must be a data slate on it here or something in here then. Well, that's a bit ominous. Oh yeah. Foul Xenos invaded in wave upon wave of claws and mandibles. 
Sacred machines drip oil and water. Cogs and gears split. How wasteful to lay waste. Oh, you can shut up for now. Alright, so I've, I've found two so far. Okay, so I've literally found the ones I found off camera, and I think I've found the final one as well. I've picked up the uh, this uh, this gun is. Oh, I like this gun a lot, but I don't know if I should have kept the flamethrower. Normally, when you're about to meet more rippers, they normally give you a flamethrower anyway, so you, it doesn't really matter. But knowing my luck, <laughs> it's gonna. Uh, it's not gonna give me one now, and I'm gonna be. Uh, well, I'm gonna be truly fucked. I don't even know what you would do. It's got a right kick to it, this has. Oh, it's pretty accurate as well. Oh, watch out. We're playing on vengeful difficulty, if you didn't know, which is uh, the difficulty below the top. The only reason why I didn't go with the top, top difficulty is because I, I assumed that this was the kind of game where, sort of like an Alien 5 Team Elite, if you play with bots, it's just not ideal, you know. So maybe we should have tried the top difficulty because it's going all right at the moment. Actually, yeah, maybe, maybe it wouldn't be a good idea. Chiron, what is our heading? We need to cross this room. Bastards. Oh, there better be something. Oh, nice. Got a guardian relic. If you didn't see the previous video, the guardian relics are the uh, relics that allow you to self revive. So, uh, absolutely fantastic. Oh, and a stim. Better use that now, actually. All this for some stinking data. Why didn't they just upload the data to the cloud so they can download it anywhere? <sighs> okay. There, a pyre blaster. <laughs> Make good use of it. More scurrying vermin. Yeah, this is the annoying bit. So this bit's a problem because you might run out of fuel sometimes. Basically, there's going to be two data things we need to interact with and you've got to protect them for a time limit and stay in the area. These little bastards are not a problem, the Rippers, but it's the other enemies that appear. And I think those two floaty guys uh, that shoot big poison bombs at you, they appear. When they appear, it's very, very easy to just die in seconds. So yeah, we might have a, might have a bit, of, bit of trouble with this bit. Hopefully not. Oh, here they come. Piss off, mate. You got cooked. Like, I need you to deal with the uh, other enemies, you two. I can't do much. Stay back there. Shit, I'm being, I'm being eaten! <clears throat> That's what I'm saying, I've got to keep using my flamethrower. <laughs> you dickheads have got to shoot the other guys. Fuck me! I'm dead again. Oh, there is a floaty guy there. I need a switch out. I need a. Oh. 
I'm doing them. Go on, go on. Perfect. Hey, Gadriel. <clears throat> I can't sw I can't swap. I'm nearly out of flamethrower fuel. My weapon is empty. I got him. I got him. Received a mortal wound. Oh, sweet. I had two revives. Well, I've got no fucking fuel. Did you not kill him, you two? You fucking idiots. Why didn't you kill him? Wait, absolute wankers. <laughs> Well done. Huh. Oh, where's the other? Was there any ammo in it? No, of course there isn't. I think I need to fully heal myself to get rid of my mortal wound. Because I think that's how you die. Oh, well done. You two actually killed someone. They should give us a uh, stats at the end to let you know what you killed and what they killed. Because <laughs> I guarantee you these bots are slacking. Oh, thank the heavens. I, am his until death. I really need to get some more stims. But yeah, because if you, f if you heal yourself all the way to the top, I think it says like mortal wound uh, removed. And then I, I think maybe you won't like have to worry about a game over. Possibly. I could be telling Porkies. Munition secured. Yeah, they're not giving me any more stims, just give me an itchy eyebrow instead. Resupply. Okay. So that bit wasn't the bit I thought it was going to be. Armor. With jump packs. It has been some time since I brought death from above. The day is not yet done, brother. <laughs> yeah, in uh, Dawn of War, if you have units wearing these, uh, they're basically melee units. So they will jump in with these jetpacks. And I think you can tell them to use these jetpacks. They will jump in and go to town on people with chainsaws. Then you have the normal space marines behind them to just shoot the shit out of the enemies. Man, Dawn of, oh, man, I love Dawn of War. It's been so many years. Restocking. But we're getting towards the uh, rough bit now. I think. The bit that I thought we were just about to do is coming up now. <laughs> Archmagos, we have reached the transmitter. Yeah. Analysis. Efficiency level below expectations. Fuck off. Here we go. Transmitter at zero state of charge. Move to generators. I can break the repairs myself. Fire the work system is in your honor. Will that interfere with operation? Okay, so you got, you got to activate them and then keep them safe while he does his work. These guys are not too bad if you've got flamethrower fuel, but it's the other bastards that appear. Special tactics ready. Munition secured. I didn't want you to pick up ammo. <laughs> yeah, you got to stay in this... Uh, this vicinity right here. Tyranny, 
I need to try and stand somewhere. Oh, what the fuck? Gotta stand somewhere where I'm not gonna get hit by bullets. It's just the overheating that causes problems. Fucking hell, stop blinding me! I think it might be because uh, we've got some enemies to kill still, maybe. I thought they all pissed off. Oh, there you go. Now they're pissing off. <laughs> I really need a stim. Oh, I didn't pull back for very long, did I? Munition secured. This is the bit I think where you get the floaty guys that appear. Use that now. Yeah, watch out for the two floaty guys that appear. Try and get them killed. But obviously, you can't switch your weapon because you've got to keep burning these bastards. So it makes it really hard, and a flamethrower doesn't reach them. In other words, do not move. Good thing about executing, because temporarily you're immune to damage. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Yeah, we gotta kill these floaty guys, otherwise, it's just gonna keep on sending shit at us. Well, hang on, hang on. Oh shit, I'm still gonna die. Switch your weapon, switch your weapon. Chat! I got one down. I could have shot a laser at me. There we go, there we go. Fuck him up, fuck him up. There we go. Oh, you two let the other one get back up in the sky, though. Primitive. Idiots. Restocking. Okay. Loading Got up. some crack grenades as well. No stims or anything. All right. Well, I mean, that went, it went as good as it could go. <laughs> One moment, brothers. Where are we going? 
Oh, I think, yeah, I think we're done. Yeah, we did it. Yeah, I think. Yeah, we did it. Oh, thank God that was over. I Sarkana, please escort Nozick to the Thunderhawk and get him off world. Yes, my lord. With pleasure. I shall be glad to be rid of these trivial duties. As I will be glad to cease the flapping of this repugnant flesh voice. <laughs> what a fucking weird are he is. Time to go. This elevator goes to the rooftop. Are we all here? Oh, I thought there was a bunch of baddies coming there. I was going to say, oh, great. <laughs> right, I think once we get up here, I'll probably have to end the video for today. I think it does save your progress mid-mission, from what I remember. I hope it bloody does. If I have to redo this whole section when I start filming tomorrow, I'm going to be pissed. Archmagus, confirm receipt of data stream. This is Lirio. Transmission received. Nozick is on the Thunderhawk. Standing by. Get him out of here. Yes, sir. Major Sargana, what's your status? We've lost a lot of land, a lot of heavy rounds, but we're still in the fight. We're coming to you now. Nozick, will they hit? Lirio, do you read me? Major, did you see what happened? No idea. We saw no impact. That is territory claimed by the swarms. We need to reach him, fast. There was an armoring chamber below. Jump packs. Oh, yes. Sir. The guardsmen. With respect, my lord. We're Cadians. We can take care of ourselves. <laughs> they, did, they didn't even have a second second thought about that, did they? They were like, all right, then, fuck ya. <laughs> we'll, we'll go and uh, check on Nozick. Can't we just let him die? I mean, I don't mind going there to rescue our brothers, the space marines, but everyone else, fuck them. The Tyranids will swarm the crash site. If Nozick is still alive, his time is limited. Our brothers aboard that Thunderhawk will make quick work of the Tyranids. I hope they survived. Yeah. Do not admit such a thought. Too many of us have fallen today. We are at war. Death waits for all of us. Well, I mean, uh, we have got some chunky armor, but how they hit the floor... I don't think anyone would be alive, but, you know, what do I know? <laughs> Alright, well... Thanks for watching, Wolf Wobbers. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Uh, next time, we're going to make use of these jump packs. And I actually prefer these jump packs to my other special ability because it's just it's so good to get out of the thick of things and then dive bomb people and float in the air and shoot enemies, especially those flying enemies and stuff like that. It's a really good ability, these jump packs. So uh, we'll try that out in the next video. And hopefully, um, well, I don't really care if uh, Nozick is alive, but hopefully our other brothers and sisters are, uh, well, there's no sisters. I hope our other brothers are uh, alive. But yeah, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And yeah, it went pretty damn well. Like, share, and join the pack today.